It's time for Coffee Talk with John. And the coffee is good this morning. <laughs> um, you know, when I do my private sessions, a question that repeatedly comes up in those sessions is, what is my purpose? What is my purpose? And it, it's interesting because when, when people ask that question, the... the they don't realize that they get to identify their purpose. They get to be their purpose. They get to experience their purpose just by being themselves. You know, when when we walk through our life, we, we, we see people, we meet people who we, who we admire and who we, who we try to emulate. And the reason you admire them and the, the reason you emulate them is because, uh, that was their purpose to be someone to emulate their purpose was to to live their message you know gandhi says my my life is my message which is a beautiful line my life is my message now what is your message your message is that you are a good caring loving kind person or you are a successful person or you are and you you look at these people who you admire and you want to model their lives but you don't model their lives you, you admire the things that, that really stand out as something that you, you want to be like. But your life will always be yours. And, you know, incorporate the things that, that ring true to you. Incorporate the things that, that you love. Incorporate the things that, that, that literally make you feel good. You know... You have to look at your life and, and, you know, your life is in constant motion. And so occasionally, you know, your world will get a little bit out, a little bit out on the edges and a little bit scattered. I'm spending today cleaning my house because over the past several weeks I've been very busy with videos and transitioning um, some other areas of my life. My son moves into his, his college dorm tomorrow and so he is now off to college. Um, so, but I have complete faith in him as he goes off to college because I lived my life and he got to see me live my life and I encouraged him in his life and being himself. He was never told what he had to do, uh, as far as career or anything of that nature, but you know, he was never, he was always encouraged not dictated to because it was important that he live his life and his life is his message you know there's a bunch of people in the world who 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 are jerks who are buttheads that's their message that they're jerks and they're buttheads now what is your message what is the message you're giving to the world are you are you expressing to the world love and kindness are you expressing to the world um, compassion are people seeing you and, and, and wanting to emulate how you are and what you're doing and you know it, it doesn't take money to be, to, to be someone to emulate it doesn't take financial or, or material possessions to be emulated you know Mother Teresa lived in Calcutta in, in a missionary and a, and a mission, sorry, not a missionary. She was a missionary. And, you know, she never had money. She never, but money moved around her in a very big way, right? But it was not, it was not about that. Her mission was, her mission was uh, helping the children of Calcutta. In fact, most people don't know this, you know, she was not supposed to leave the mission. Not supposed to go out in the street, but she could see the kids out from her window. So she petitioned all the way to the Vatican to get out of the door because that was her mission. You know, her life is her mission to get out there and do that work and do the things. And, you know, what is your mission? What is your mission to be the greatest parent in the world so that, you know, the, the children can see an example of that? Is your mission to be the greatest boss or leader in the world so people can see a kind leader and, and, express the 
that into their world and into their business. You know, are are you is your mission to feed the poor? You know, you know you 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 get to create your mission, but your life, the actions you take, are are your me your message. Those the actions you take are your message. And I, I know I'm sure you know a lot of people who say a lot of things and never do them. That's their message. Do you, do you think of them as achievers? No, you think of them as people who don't follow through, because that's their message. So, what is your message? Are you are you out there doing this? Are you out there being that loving, caring person, and and showing the world love? The more of us that show the world love, the more of us that bring our truth out, uh, our belief in a loving world, the more our world changes, because now we're we're spreading our message by example. And that example changes the world. You guys have a great day. And I'll talk to you soon. See ya. Bye. Hey guys, thank you so much for your support of the channel. You know, every day I pour my heart into creating these videos so that they bring value. That's my, that's my goal. That's my intention. And if they have brought value to you and you have the means, directly below this video you're going to see a donation link. You can donate as, as little or as much as you'd like if you have found value. Also, you can go to johnofnew.com, pick up my regression, which is the, the moment of me meeting Jeshua and witnessing the crucifixion is on that regression. My meditations, my mini courses, even prints of my Jeshua painting are available on the johnofnew.com website. So if you have the means and you, and you would like to make a purchase or make a donation, please feel free because this channel solely exists by your generosity. And I am completely grateful to you for allowing me to speak my truth and hopefully bringing value to you. You guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon. See ya. Bye.